Oh, hey everybody, how are you? Uh, this is Tom, I'm John. We're gonna answer your question from Brian's voice off screen. Here we go. Okay, question number one. Tom, when Russell Wilson gets his big new contract, do you think there will be a clause that stipulates he has to be less boring? <laughs> <laughs> oh. That be, oh, that's, oh, man. A, that's a great question, but no, they actually, I think he needs to be even more boring. I think if he was trying to be too fancy with that ball, that pass, that infamous pass, if he had just thrown it right to the receiver instead of trying to lead him, in other words, being fancy and interesting, mm -hmm. that might not have happened. So I'm okay. I don't care how much money he makes. The more boring, the better, because I'd rather him be boring on the field and win. I think, it, yeah, good. John. Yeah, oh yes, hi. Seriously, did you eat the lasagna? No. Uh, John, <laughs> John, in a movie about your life, who would you cast to play you? Uh, is it, like, my life as it is, or my life as I'd want it to be? <laughs> <laughs> Daniel Craig is the answer to the second No, no, one. I want, uh, you know, it's okay. It's like, am, I, am I shirtless a lot? Because I don't normally walk around shirtless. Are there a lot of sex scenes? Because I mean, if it's a comedy, there's somebody else doing it, right? And I don't really know anybody. My knowledge of actors dropped off in 1986, so yeah. who would be good? Well, the guy, I'm, I'm blanking on his name right now, but the guy, the silver fox guy in Mad Men. No, 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 Tom, I, I wouldn't have silver hair. <laughs> you know, I would have blonde hair again. Come on. No, he's, 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 a, he's a great ladies' man. Okay. Very well, good looking. Then I guess that guy. Yeah. And I do a lot of the stuff that they do in House of Cards, where I look to the camera and then say something. But I'm watching House of Cards now. Kevin Spacey doing you. That would be funny. That'd be good. Kevin Spacey, there's your answer.